An Einstein ring is a visible phenomenon in space. The significance of this event relates to light, gravity, and the alignment of different objects in space. To understand what's really going on in an Einstein ring, we need to take a closer look at all of these things. So since it's a visible phenomenon in space, we need to look at how light moves through space. Light will continue to move through space in a straight line until it either hits an object or passes close to a massive object like a star or a black hole. When light passes close to a massive object in space, the path of light is bent or distorted from its original path. Similar to light passing through an optical lens, which is why it's called gravitational lensing. This effect happens to all electromagnetic radiation, which visible light is just a tiny part. We use light as a shortcut for this. The moving of the path of light follows can be noticed when, from the point of view of an observer, one star or even a galaxy is almost behind another one. As a result, as far as the observer is concerned, the more distant object moves closer to aligning with the closer object. The light is bent by the intervening object, which means the observer appears to see the more distant object move or even you can see the same object appear in two different locations. This apparent ability to visually move objects in space is a way of being able to detect black holes in space. The black hole itself isn't observed, instead the light moving is, and as a result the location of a black hole can be inferred from the movement or the displacement of the light. The effect of distant object appearing in two places happens when some of the light passes to the right of the intervening object and some to the left. However, the observer and distant object and the intervening object are precisely in line with each other. The light from the distant object doesn't just pass to the left and to the right of the intervening object to reach the observer. Instead, also passes above and below, in fact all around the intervening object. And as a result, instead of distant object being in two places, forms a complete ring or halo around the intervening object. And it's this halo which is the Einstein ring. The lensing effect produced by the gravity of a star, a black hole, or even a galaxy was predicted by Albert Einstein's theory of general relativity as an enormous mass in space results in the bending of space-time. It also alters the path of light that travels through the distortion. As a result of his theories, a special case of gravitational lensing is named after him. That's why it's an Einstein ring.